Shout out Big Boogie. I had Boogie in the studio a couple weeks ago. We shot this incredible interview. One of the conversations that we talked about was his first conversation with an artist that he had on his last project, The Final Nightmare, on a song called I Got You Girl. Dage Loaf made a shocking appearance on Boogie's project, and I kind of was like, yo, I didn't expect you two to work with each other. Could you tell me a little bit more about how you linked with Dage Loaf? And uh, Boogie is, is quite the storyteller. He explains in this interview that I did with them how him and Dage Loaf linked on the West Coast. If you want to watch that interview in totality, check the description or comment area for more details. All right? Check out this clip. Back to this final nightmare project. Yeah. Dage Loaf was the one random feature. I was like, okay, maybe <laughs> Big Boogie's like he... he Listen to Dave Loaf uh, growing up or when he was coming up or whatever. Where did that one come from? Out of uh, there was just the one feature. I was like, mm, this is interesting. What, what, how did that connection come about? I was in, Ke I was in Kelly. I was in California. Me and I we got it. <laughs> and, uh, my wrist beat my little brother Cuba. Mm. Uh, he was there with me. What I was so I was so happy, bro. I'm like <laughs> I'm like I'm like God, where we going? Yeah. He just my head up standing outside. Me him. It was just me him. His people, our people, so he was like, I was just getting getting, right, getting right, right, good right. with him. So, man, we in California outside doing the same night. I met little baby. Um, little baby was standing outside like a normal person. So I'm looking at this man like, bro, that, what, Very you, normal what is you, what, what like, bro, Very baby? Normal. I'm like, baby, what is you doing, bro? Like, he, but he was like, he was like, oh, Boogie, what's up, bro? I was like, man, no, what you got going? Mm. But we went to the studio that night, and I'm like, God, what the, I'm like, why are they know? <laughs> so, but I told my little brother, say, yup, he ain't lying. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. She right there in the studio. Yup, there she go. Day low. Ooh, wee. I'm sweating right now. I said, man, well, this <laughs> man crazy. Right, so, man, I swear to God, man. Right, 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 I swear to God, man. So, I'm like, what? That's crazy. Yeah, she in there making a banger. I'm like, man, they later the goat. So, when I, I met her and everything, I would come, but my hands were sweating, though. <laughs> I thought you had to pull the Gotti string for that, but I guess nah, you didn't nah. have to use it. I so you still it. got within the bag. Because, okay, yeah. Moneybag admittedly just pulled the Gotti string for that Janae Aiko record on um, A Gangsta's Pain. Nah, like, nah, like, but, okay, she knew, like, Gotti was like, he didn't say nothing. Mm -hmm. he, he was like, he was like, Dave, I want you to meet Boogie. Mm -hmm. uh, so she was like, hey, how you doing? He was like, you know, he, yeah, he, he's CMG now. He, that's all, this is my artist. Right. So boom, and she was like, okay, congratulations. She was like, she was like yeah, she was like, it's good. What you gonna do with yeah. it? Like I'm lit. You hear me? So so uh, Dame, uh, he's CMG too. One of right. our, one of our yeah, people. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Dame was like, like Dave, you ain't ready for Boogie. Mm -hmm. That's Boogie with the moves. <laughs> so she like, what? She was like, let, let me hear some. So I let her hear my my, my R and B music, the, the slow jams. Mm -hmm. And so she was, and I danced too. I danced for it and everything. So she like, I got it. What you gonna do with him? <laughs> like. That's a different type of ball game for you. <laughs> and he's just sitting back laughing. He like, you'll see. Yeah. Like you, you gonna see him. We gonna be big. That's all he was saying. And then the record comes. Y'all put the play together. Then like, she, it was like she said out her mouth. Did nobody say nothing about Lincoln? I didn't say nothing about. Okay, I, I want you to. Oh, this me right here. I'm, right. I'm not on none of that. Well, like, why, why, why not though? I mean, because you, you I'm know, already. You know you I'm the, already. You, know you wanted to feature, Boogie. You know you wanted to. I didn't care if I didn't get it. Like okay. because I knew I'm gonna be big regardless. I mm -hmm. know I, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be next to Michael Jackson, Chris Brown. Them. I know. Mm -hmm. I know where I'm going. Well, I know where I'm going. Well, Michael Jackson's dead. So yeah, rest Chris in peace Brown. to him. Yeah. So. I'm gonna be in their positions. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I'm gonna be one of them. Okay. I got so you. Yeah. I'm gonna be big regardless. You know what I'm saying? Like I got faith in me regardless. Like I'm gonna be Al Green. Now. I, I like believe I'm it. going that way. I believe. So it. I was just sitting. My it came out of my mouth. She was like, "I want Boogie to get on this. I want Boogie to get on some of my mm. stuff." Oh, did you get? Did you return the favor? What? Right heard, there or not? I ain't heard that. My good. I man, I got right on her song. Yeah. That was her song. Okay. Oh I yeah, oh, did you girl. take it? Like, cause you, you use it like she gave it to me. Like ah, she see. was like she was like okay. She was like you can have it. Like mm. she she did the chord and I did and I did my verse. You see what I'm saying? So it was dead on it. 